Hi, it's Stella from Maple University, and this is Stella's short and sweet preview for The Girl Who Made the Stars from Final Frontier Games. <sighs> ah, once upon a time, there's a story about the girl who turned wood ash and roots into stars that light the ways for her people to go adventuring and find their way home. The game plays 1-4 to four players, with mechanics such as drafting, tile placement, and order fulfillment. The game is of light to medium complexity. In the game, players are creating star constellations on their own boards to create light pieces that connect the parts on the main board for points and to make ways to collect items for points. At the start of the round, players draw three star tiles, placing them on their own boards, trying to enclose the parts to get that color light piece. Then bonus tokens get drawn and thrown into the night sky ball. Each player will draft, either taking it as a light piece, the color depends on where it lands, or resolving the tile, usually a bonus action that round. Each player then does two actions before turn goes to the next player. Players can lay paths to score the points and to make a specific item available to be foraged. So players can forage, assigning a meeple, paying the light pieces, cost shown and take the item. Or make offering, giving up the picked items to score the points. Or stargazing, putting a meeple on the track around the night sky ball so the player will get extra bonus token from drafting next round onwards. Another action players can do is taking a stardust, good for closing off star constellations on your board, and resting, taking any or all of their meeples from the board. After 8 rounds, the game ends and the player with the most points wins. This is a beautiful story about the creation of the stars and the Milky Way. And in the game, you are really creating these star pathways. Make a wish! Well, you do need to watch out your opponents also, how many light pieces they have, what items they have been collecting, because often, the sooner you score pathways or close your constellation on your own board, the higher the points you get, and the next round it scores lower points. Pretty competitive! When you fulfill an order at offering, the card will score you more points, but once they're gone, you cannot fill the same one later on. The tile and star puzzle on your player board is an individual special puzzle that can be done simultaneously by all players. So, if you like individual challenge and interaction at the same time, you'll probably like The Girl Who Made The Stars. So thanks for watching, folks! Check out The Girl Who Made The Stars on Kickstarter. I'll put the link in the description below for you. We'll also have how to play video coming soon, so stay tuned! The components featured in this video are prototype, so rules and artwork are not final. You would help us by LSE, like the video, subscribe and hit the bell, and comments below what stories do you think will make good board games. I also share my board games journey on Instagram, so hopefully I will see you there too. See you in my next videos. Bye!